How's it going YouTube? Links Forte here bringing you an IBL team update. It's not a channel update, okay? Not a channel update. It's a team update. <laughs> so, um, remember I, I said I took over the IBL team. No battles had been done, but the draft had been done. And so when I took over the team, it wasn't a team I drafted. Even though, you know, I just repeated myself like five times just then. But it wasn't a team I drafted. And so I wasn't particularly happy with it. I was trying to understand it. And I looked at the team originally. Um, I'm going to pull it up here. The original team was Tapu Bulu, Nia Lego, Vaporeon, Weavile, Darmanitan, Como O, Bronzong, Skuntank, <clears throat> Zerker Tree, Sandslash, Golur. Now, some of you are probably looking at this team and like, why did you change anything from this team? This is a great team. It's a powerful team. On paper, yes, it is powerful. The thing I didn't like about it is that it didn't gel the way I like to play. Like, you could look at this team and say, oh, it's a bulky offense. Ah, maybe. I like speed, though. I'm a person who plays with speed. If I don't play with speed, like whether it's like speed control or sticky webs or thunder waving, a lot of stuff, I need speed on my team. Or I have fast Pokemon in general, something. I just need speed. Like, I'm typically a balanced player, so I need I need some hitters and I need some defenders, mostly hitters and sometimes revenge killers, and that's the way I like to play. And I looked at this team and was like, only two Pokemon hit over 100 speed, Weavile and Neolego. Darmanitan is almost there at base 95, but I just didn't like it. Um, I didn't like how, you know, only three Pokemon were 95 plus. I, I, it didn't fit me. Um, so, you know, and if you guys need like a number to see how fast this team wasn't, uh, average the 11 Pokemon here, it's 78.91. I don't like that <laughs> it's a little too slow and uh, if you guys want a comparison my NPL team a team I haven't touched yet, I haven't made any trades or free agency pickups or anything like that that team is 85.64 average and that has like four or five Pokemon over base 100 that's my typical style like I don't mind a Pokemon being like base 30 speed like bronze on 33 I don't mind that I just need, like, if you're going to be a hard hitter, I kind of want you to be fast. Or, you know, you can be a fast Pokemon and not have everything going for you. But, like, Neo Lego being a base 103, to me, is not the greatest of things. Because it's a dedicated stealth rocker, in my opinion. It's a fast stealth rocker. Um, yeah, it, you know, it has a great special defense, but it has it's four times weakness to ground. And it's... It's, it's not worth it in my opinion so let me just go over the changes I made overall like I, I made some changes twice actually so let me go over the first set of changes so like I said you got the team here that you see on the screen um, this is before I did any battles I was allowed to make three changes or up to three changes and you know I kind of looked at this team and was like I was trying to figure out how it was supposed to work like you have Bulu, uh, Neo Lego, and Bronzong as the Fairy Dragon Steel. Or, I mean, Bulu, Como, -O, and Bronzong as the Fairy Dragon Steel. And I, I was not happy with that. I mean, Como -O is a setup Pokemon, of course. But the thing is, Como -O takes too much. Like, it takes too much to get set up. And it's a quad weakness to Fairy, which is very common, especially in the draft format. It's. You get in a Fairy Pokemon like any fairy Pokemon and Como is almost always forced out um, it, it's it's too slow for what it is in my opinion it's a hard hitter but it's too slow for what it is in my opinion but anyway um I was looking at everything and trying to think okay you know I have Vaporeon here as a healer um, but I don't want to have to rely on Vaporeon to be my cleric I like Vaporeon, but I don't want it to 100% be a cleric every single battle in and out. I don't like Como O as my dragon, so I looked over, you know, what dragons were available that I that I could take. And Bulu, I was on the fence about. Um, but ultimately, the changes I made were Bulu, Como O, and Sandslash. I switched those out for Kartana, Zygarde 10%, and Granbull. Kartana and Zygarde alone. 
bumped my average speed to 84.73. That's pretty much on par with my MPL team. And I, I was happy. I have a physical wall in Gramble as well as a cleric in Gramble. Uh, Zygarde, I have a fast dragon who can set up, be choice bandit. Like you guys have already seen one battle. I choice scarf that thing. Um, and he has a, the most spammable move in Thousand Arrows right now. So, and I've always wanted to try Zygarde. Granted, I want Zygarde 50%, but I'll take 10%. Um, just, you know, so I can spam uh, Thousand Arrows. And Kartana is something, you know, I tried out in the MPL minors. Not the, <laughs> not the great, not with great success, but Kartana has a lot of upside. Um, a little bit more than Bulu, just because Bulu doesn't get play rough. Like, that's kind of one of the things I don't like about a couple of the Tapus. Like, Tapu Lele and Tapu Fini are fine because they get Moonblast. But when it comes to Bulu and um, Coco, they're physical. They Well, they should be physical. Coco's not physical because it doesn't get the moves to be physical. But their their stats say this is a physical Pokemon and there's no play rough for, for them. So I don't like that. And Granted, Bulu hits like a truck with just Wood Hammer. You spam Wood Hammer and everything pretty well. Most things take a lot of damage. So yeah, I, I swapped out Kartana, or I swapped out Bulu for Kartana, Como O for Zygarde, and Sand Slash, Sand Slash for Grand Bull. And I'm not disappointed with those pickups at all. Like, uh, I've already used Zygarde and Kartana, like, amazing. Like in my first battle, Zygarde got two kills, I think it was. And then in the second battle, I think Kartana got four kills or three kills, something like that. Kartana finished the battle, won the battle for me in the end. Um, just because of the way I played it and just because of how hard or how Kartana hits and things like that. So I think I made the changes for the better. Um, but yeah, that's that's the that was the change in the team originally. Now, another thing that I didn't like about this team was that I did not have a rapid spinner. Um, I don't like having a draft team without a spinner because it means that if I choose if I choose to bring something like Weavile, like Weavile, it, Weavile needs uh, defog support or hazard control. It doesn't have to be every battle, but if Weavile is going to be something like, you know, I try to set up with and I want to bring a focus ash, then Weavile needs hazard support. Or hazard control just to be able to remove hazards and I don't like having to carry um, defog if I don't need to because for instance if I'm not able to set up with Weavile like, uh, I did this in my MPL battle I brought swords dance and if I'm not able to set up a swords dance that means I need help from my hazards but if I'm trying to remove hazards to keep Weavile you know at a decent amount of health you know I can't use defog to get away my opponent's hazards because it, it could hurt me and I think my voice just cracked <laughs> I'm too old to be you know having my voice crack but um so yeah I, I just looked at this team and was like dude I I need a rapid spinner and I looked at what was available and I think there were like two mods available but one of them I was just like no I'm not getting this and like I could have gone back to sand slash but no I, I was not picking up sand slash because I still had color and I just didn't like Sand Slash. Um, and so I'm just scrolling through my team and just like, okay, what can I do? But there was a Pokemon I liked. The, the thing was that for me to pick it up, I would have to drop something else that was a little bit higher to, uh, I would have to drop something else so I could afford it and then pick up something else that was like a lower rating or a lower price Pokemon. And so, I started scrolling to see what like what kind of things I could do. I was like, man, I really want to make this change and get a rapid spinner. So eventually, I found my change. I dropped Nihilego, and I dropped uh, Golurk. I picked up Pelipper, and I picked up Kabutops. Like I said, Kabutops gives me a rapid spinner, and for what it's worth, Pelipper gives me <laughs> Defog. But this also, it became a great pair because it gives me rain and this team it's not like it does horrible in rain like this team actually does pretty decent in rain um the only thing you know that's bad about this team now 
is that I don't have anything to absorb the bolts with. Oh no, I have Zygarde, never mind, ignore that. <laughs> I was just thinking I don't have a ground type. No, I have Tiger. Um But no. Like the only bad thing about this team is my, my speed dipped a little bit to 81.73. So it dipped three points, which is not a big deal because when you really think about it, Kabutops does get swift swift swim. Um so it's kind of a it's still a good speed. Like I don't remember what like once it's doubled, I don't remember what it went to, but I know it's higher than whatever. It, it's once you know if you can factor into Kabutop speed being double, it's probably faster than the eighty four seventy three. But um, also just this team in general, man, I I'm really liking it. I just have to you know figure out how I want it to work. I I do get one more transaction. I don't know if there will be any more trades or free agents pickups, but you never know. Um, but I'm liking the team the way I, you know, the, the changes I made. I just wanted to, you know, let you guys know what was going on with this team. And I think that's it. This video is long enough. Like, I've just been rambling. I don't know why. There's no reason, reason for me to ramble like I'm doing right now. <laughs> um, yeah, I think that's it. So this is the new team. It's Kartana, Pelipper, Vaporeon, Weavile, Darmanitan, Zygar 10%, Bronzong, Skuntank, Zerkutri, Granbull, and Kabutops. And like I said, I really like this team, and hopefully, you know, we can continue to pick up some wins. And uh, that's it. I am out of here, you guys. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Peace.